lakini sasa hivi mtazamaji naarifiwa kwamba gavana wa kaunti ya Kisumu Anyang Nyongo anaongoza hafla ya uzinduzi ama ufunguzi wa hospitali ya Rata hivyo basi hebu tuelekee pale tupate taarifa hiyo kisha tutarejea kuendelea na mazungumzo zaidi hapa kwenye studio to empower the community health workers to get more people coming to this facility to respond to the problems they're seeing in the villages i would like to express my deepest gratitude to the safaricom foundation for their invaluable partnership and support in making this endeavor a reality it is through such collaborations that we can bring about meaningful change in the lives of our citizens let me underscore that it is through such co 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 collaboration that we can bring, bring about meaningful change in the lives of our citizens together we are taking a giant step towards realizing our shared vision of a community where every household has the opportunity to thrive where every household has the opportunity to thrive what every citizen needs in this nation is to satisfy their basic needs basic needs of housing of food of health of education and security without those five a kenyan citizen cannot feel at home wherever they live ladies and gentlemen today as we break ground on the rata maternal and child health complex i have a vision that this facility will in the near future expand its services to provide refuge to adolescent girls abandoned by their families when pregnant the kenya demographic and health survey 2022 report showed that 11.1 percent of girls and young women aged 15 to 19 in kisumu have experienced pregnancy one out of 10 no how one out of 10 is it because it's 11.1% almost one out of 10 one out of 10 girls even be, between the ages of 11 to 19 in kisumu county have experienced pregnancy we are aware of the discrimination that faces these young women and therefore the facility will be a lifeline for those who need it most it will provide a nurturing environment for these young mothers to continue their education while caring for their children it will represent a powerful tool for breaking the cycle of poverty as we know adolescent pregnancies are more likely to occur among disadvantaged communities we must acknowledge that poverty and lack of education are often intertwined with the challenges of adolescent pregnancy <clears throat> that has six week reminders that we have work to do <clears throat> approximately 4 in 10 women aged 15 to 19 with no education have experienced pregnancy in other words the less education a student is or a girl is the more likely that the likely to get pregnancy at an early age compared to only 5% of those with more, with more than secondary education moreover adolescent pregnancies are more prevalent among poorest communities where 21% of women mtazamaji huyo ni gavana wa kaunti ya Kisumu Profesa Anyang Nyongo akizungumza katika ile hafla uzinduzi wa hospitali ya Rata ambapo anazungumza tu kuhusiana na afya ya jamii na hivyo basi ni taarifa ambayo kikosi chetu katika kaunti hiyo kitakuwa kinatuandalia na kutupa kwa kina